Breeds and Crypto. I'm your host, Mr. Big Breeds, coming to you live from Reservation somewhere, taking a look at NCT and a few other coins to uh, continue the night. I hope you had a good Wednesday afternoon, Wednesday evening, and uh, let's get this night started. Well, let's get it started. Take a look at NCT. NCT is coming in 0379. Had a little bit of dippy action. Decent correction to the downside, like I was talking about in the last video. When I started seeing this, you know, a little bit of a, you know, consolidation to the upside here, I started looking for capitulation, and we got it. That's it. We came back down to that 618.0379. Classic setup. And uh, here we are back at the 618.0379. Could possibly seen some lower price action uh we definitely keep on that support if we do lose that support, we could be seeing some lower price action down to the 76 at 0 0.0346 and uh you know if we do start seeing some uh you know bullish action to the upside we definitely gotta get back over that 0 0.0402 grab some support consolidation make it work to this 0 0.0425 and as far as get some extremely bullish action to move to the upside we definitely for that 0 0.0500, grab some support consolidation, start working on that next leg up. So, as far as but as far as uh, <laughs> T goes, uh, with BTC being so undecided, could possibly see some sideways action above the 618. Uh, you know, until the market starts getting that reversal to the upside, and then we start seeing some higher price action. Uh, you know, if we do start, continue to get some more dippy action, we definitely need to keep an eye on that support of the 786 at 0.0346. And, uh, you know, if we do lose this support up here, the 618 could possibly come see some consolidation down to the 786, where we could possibly see some sideways action until BTC starts getting some correction to the upside, and then we start getting some movement as well. So, keep an eye on that price action. Keep Keeping eye on BTC, a lot of people wondering, you know, what's going on with the market? Why is it not moving out at the way it's supposed to be? Well, you know, you can't ever tell what the market, you know, the market does, the market does, you know, and right now we got a lot of stuff going on in the market right now. We got, uh, you know, Ukraine and Russia going, you know, got that scenario going on right now. We got toxic COVID, so definitely has this accumulation phase going on a little bit longer, but you know, I'm definitely out here taking advantage. I'm loving that price action. The sales is going on. We got, you know, NCT coming at 0 0.0378, able to afford a lot of the projects out here, more projects than, you know, thought so you know in the t as, as, as long as time keeps going we keep as long as those bears keep keeping those prices down low definitely keeps me out here accumulating so i uh, loving the price action all the way around excited to see where we're going as far as nct so uh keep it on that price action keep it on the news and uh keep it on P See, we'll do some follow-up videos tomorrow and see where we're at. Moving on up to scale. Scale coming in at 0 0.2157. Definitely affected as well. Didn't quite get the uh, <laughs> the move to the downside like we, uh, you know, a lot of coins did. But looks like it's holding pretty decently. Uh, could possibly come back down to that 0 0.1839 at the 618 for some decent correction. And, uh, you know, could possibly see some lower price action down to the 786 at 0.04. Four, five, three. If we do continue to get some dippy action, looks like there could be a little flash of green in there, a little bit of the girl. So I <laughs> could be getting that bounce to the upside. Um, as far as uh, you know, getting some decent moves to the upside. Let's go back up to the year date here and uh, definitely got to scan back out here a little bit. Scale's been having like a lot of movement, you know, around the market today on just, you know, basically it's consolidating down to some lower price action, but definitely was trying to make some moves to the upside and uh, couldn't quite make it over that, uh, the 76 at point two nine two zero. Had a little bit of pullback down to the, uh, you know, down to some lower price action coming at point two one five seven. So, you know, definitely came down and tested that support at point two one oh nine. So if we do continue to see some lower price action possibly see some consolidation down to the 618 at point one eight three nine and uh, if we do lose that support at the point one eight three nine definitely could see some consolidation down to the 786 at point one four five three i've been definitely out here looking for that price action we talked about that in the last video could possibly see that lower price action and if we do lose that 786 at a uh, point one that <laughs> if we do lose that support at the 786 at point one four five three definitely going to see some lower price action so you know definitely excited to see where we're going as far as scale just creeped its way up there over the past few <laughs> over the past week or so made its back way back up working on some decent recovery to the upside so as far as getting some you know bullish action it moves to the upside we definitely gotta get back over that uh 786 at 0.2920 grab some support consolidation make it up to the 618 at 0.4926 and as far as getting some extremely bullish action it moves to the upside 
back for that is 0.7745 grab some support consolidation make our way up to that dollar 23 and start heading into that retail price action so definitely excited to see where we're going with scale so everybody in scale good luck we'll tomorrow and see where we're at moving up to ACH ACH coming at 0.0389 a little bit of love going on <laughs> and loving that accumulation <laughs> but, uh, uh, definitely uh, you know could be possibly setting up with this sideways action like we were talking about in the last video with PTC being so undecided as far as getting some decent moves to the upside uh, we definitely Get back over that 76 at 0.0654. Grab some support consolidation. Make your way up to the 618 at 0 0.1034. And as far as getting some extremely bullish action and moves to the upside, we get, gotta get back over that 0.2431. Grab some support consolidation. Start making that next leg up. So that would be the awesome, amazing bullish scenario with BTC being so undecided. Could possibly just see some sideways action until the market starts making some moves to the upside. So keep an eye on that price action. And uh, if we do start seeing some lower price action, we gotta keep an eye on that support at 0.0171. If we lose that support, definitely going to be in that how low can you go scenario. So uh, keep an eye on that price action. We'll do a follow-up video tomorrow and see where we're at. So everybody in ACH, good luck. Moving on to API 3. API 3 coming at 502. <laughs> Moving to DP action. Just keep battling with that 5 support we lost it again could possibly be seeing some lower price action uh you know definitely been excited to see where we're going with api 3 could possibly be some action back to the upside uh, i'd set up with the sideways scenario like we were talking about with uh you know getting that sideways action underneath the 76 uh you know as far as btc you know being so undecided scenarios are setting up with a lot of the coins out here a lot of stuff setting up with the sideways action just wait for btc to give confirmation that it's you know it's time to start working on the next leg up so you know like we were you know i definitely like we were talking about the last videos you know i definitely would feel more comfortable with btc around 48.8 making some moves to the upside but you know definitely out here loving the sales price action loving the accumulation going on now definitely excited to see where we're going into the weeks uh, as far as uh api3 making some moves to the upside Make our way back over that 76 uh, 575. Grab some spark consolidation. Make your way up to 621. And as far as getting some extremely bullish action moves to the upside, we gotta get back over that 727. Make our way up to the 792. Grab some good strong support consolidation and start making our moves up to the upside. So definitely excited to see where we're going with API 3. You know, a lot of these uh, higher price coins definitely move a little bit different, so it could be possibly setting up on a bigger type of uh, flag scenario. But, you know, I'm definitely excited to see where we're going with this price action here. Uh, so, we're going to APA. Good luck. We'll do some follow up videos tomorrow and see where we're at. Moving on up to IOTIX. IOTIX coming at 0 0.0972. <laughs> definitely got a good sale going on here. Uh, you know, definitely loving that price action. I'm definitely excited to see where we're going. Uh, accumulation uh, if we start getting some lower price action there you know I'm definitely gonna <laughs> you know, that accumulation uh, so but as far as uh, you know BTC being so excited could possibly be setting up with some sideways action until BTC starts making some moves to the upside uh, but as far as getting some bullish action and moves to the upside we got to get back over the at point one seven one four grab some support talk and <laughs> excuse me grab some support consolidation and start making our way up to the 618.2418 as far as get some extremely bullish action moves to the upside we gotta get back over that 0 0.3407 grab some support consolidation make our, that, make our way over that 0 0.5007 and uh <laughs> start working out that breakout action to the upside so this would be the awesome amazing bullish scenario with btc being so on the side it could possibly see some sideways action until the market starts correcting to the upside so uh keep an eye on this support here at 0.0817 if we do come back down and test that support if we do lose that support i've been out here lurking for that lower price action that sub eight cent area uh definitely lurking like a shark i got the coffee going i'm got my eyes on that support and i'm definitely waiting and ready for some accumulation and some lower price action but you know could be wishful thinking at this point it just remains to be seen so for everybody and all the coins we talked about tonight good luck and uh, you always got to remember this is not financial advice these are my views and opinions on the market only and you always got to do what's right for you so you also have a good afternoon good evening good morning good night uh mr big braids is signing now be sure to click on the uh <laughs> on the picture here to like and subscribe and uh we'll catch you all tomorrow and uh Everybody good luck. Mr. Big Braid sign out.